All right, hi everybody, John Meadows here, and uh, this is another exercise index video, and this is kind of a unique one, but you know I like to travel around to different gyms and just show you the different kinds of machines and different equipment that's out there. I also like for you to see different bars. You know, not every gym is like an Elite FTS that has 100 different bars. But I got um, uh, Chris Duffin's bar here uh, from Kabuki Strength Labs, and I've been playing around with this. I've done, this is, this will be my third workout with it. And I wanted to share this with you because before I shared the video, I wanted to test it out. Now, if you guys follow my programs, you know, I very rarely, actually, I never bench press first just because issues with connective tissue and a bunch of near pec tears I've had. This position is just too risky for me. But uh, this bar, um, I am super happy with it because, I mean, so there's a couple things. First, so first of all, look at the angle right here. So you've got a little bit of a curved angle there. Like a, it's almost like a camber. And that allows you to get more range of motion. Now, my first thought was, <laughs> I don't know that I want more range of motion because the further I go down, the more uh, potential risk there is. But if you look at uh, where you grip the bar, so we've got multiple handles here. It's like a Swiss bar, except that they're not straight. If you see, there's a little, it's almost like there's a tiny bit of pronation, just a little. But this change in grip, it just takes the stress out of this area right here where I'm, where I'm worried. I don't feel, feel it right there anymore. And not only that, I think with a little bit of pronation, and actually I feel pretty powerful. I actually feel pretty strong on this. I'm not a strong bench presser, but I feel pretty good on these. So, um, I'm very, very happy with this bar. Uh, like I said, this is my third workout doing it. I'm warmed up today. Let me show you what it looks like. We've got three different grips. You know, obviously as you move the bar in more, you, it would be more tricep. I'm gonna do a set here on the middle. Then I'll probably do a set outside as well, but let me do a set uh, right here. So you want your hands right in the middle. You don't want them up here and you don't want them down here. You don't want the bar tipping. So you wanna get right in the middle. Okay, ready? Oh. Just drop down in there. <clears throat> so, for me, that feels really good. I don't feel the shoulder stress. It feels like a very safe exercise. Feels like a great exercise for just upper body strength. I, I, I would even say this is probably good for athletes. Um, but anyways, so I'm gonna rest here for a second and then we're gonna go out and I'll show you a little wider grip. Yeah, you're good right there, that's good. Again, hands right in the middle. See how he's just dropping his elbows right in there? Ready? So uh, I'm going to do my last set now. Just keep this waiting. I'm going to get some reps. I'm going to go a little wider. Um, I, I should probably mention the name of the bar, the Cadillac bar, the Cadillac of bars, <laughs> the Cadillac bar. So try a few more reps. Now I'm going to go out wide. Again, you don't want your hands here. You don't want them all the way up here. You want them nice right in the middle. Okay. Drop right in there. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. oh, so Cadillac bar from Kabuki Strength Labs. I have absolutely zero hesitation giving this thing a thumbs up. Really, really good bar. So if you guys are looking for a new bar to try, if you have maybe a tendency to get injured like I do in your pec insertions, definitely try this. So anyways, just wanted to share this with you in an exercise index video. We'll see you next time.